All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to what might be the final chapter of our Space Marines 2 playthrough here on the channel. We have assembled our entire Ultramarine Corps. We have some Rhinos down there, a Dreadnought, a couple Dreadnoughts, and a ton of Ultramarines ready to put their life on the line, honor the blue of their chapter for Ultramar. You can see we have some soldiers up here as well, and I'm looking forward to seeing where this entire story ends. I'm, I'm sad that it's, a, it's quite a short experience, but at the same time, I'm excited to get through the campaign and then start tackling some of the online multiplayer missions and put some chapter colors of the Black Templars onto my character and make my own Space Marine. So looking forward to it. We have to stop by the armory here quickly, just see if there's anything new that we might be able to deck out Titus with before embarking on this final epic saga. You can see a Dreadnought over there being worked on. This is so cool. Everybody's just assembling. Lieutenant Titus, blessings of the Undersire upon you. Galio, theoretically... The Tacticus armor withstand a suborbital drop. Gravis is too cumbersome for our needs. Negative. Extreme risk. Dense debris fields litter the entry flight path. But if we avoid the debris, could we survive the descent? Calculating. Survival probability equal to 62.4136. Unacceptably low. Thank you, Galio. All right, so we're going to be dropping into the planet from the Dreadnought. <laughs> or from the uh, Battle Bar, sorry. Armor. It is a sound strategy. But a 38% failure rate. We are facing much less favorable odds today. Yeah, it's true. I'll take those odds any day. So it looks like we weren't able to equip a melee weapon. Makes me kind of think that we're going to get the hammer in this mission. Usually when that happens, you get to assign one right off the bat. So we'll hopefully be able to check that one out. Let's go meet with our six brave soldiers before we battle on Demirius. Brothers, our captain's words need no further embellishment. I will speak only of practical concerns. The heretics will employ absolute deception. You will be assaulted by lies and illusion. The only true ground you will find down there will be each other. Trust only your brothers and your instincts. Now go forth and lay waste to our enemies. For the Emperor! For the Emperor! All right, let's do it. I can only imagine what this mission is going to throw at us. It's been so awesome to see what this game has conjured up so far. And it all is leading to this epic moment of a battle against the Xenos, a battle against the heretics. So Dawn's descent. The enemy has taken control of the Adeptus Mechanicus facility with Luz inside. Under the direction of the uh, Imra, traitor forces repel any attempt at recapture, overcome the resistance, and prevent the activation of Project Aurora. Let's get it, baby. Have you ever done this before? You mean drop through an active combat zone, dodging flak, enemy ships, and burning wreckage on the way down? Exactly. No. This will be a first. The Codex Astartes does not support this action. But I am looking forward to it. Stay close. It's almost impossible to regroup if we're separated. 60 seconds. Helmets! Sir! I must apologize for my actions on our hands. Not necessary. I fell prey to suspicion almost killed you. When I was a young captain, one of my men questioned my motives, brushed his concerns aside, and I paid the price. Your suspicions arose because I failed to answer your doubts. As I failed to answer his. Stand by for some orbital drop. I'm honored to fight beside you both. As are we, brother. You grew up on Calf. No way, a 
are we actually gonna control it? Oh my gosh! Holy terror! All specs cannot keep up with all this oh. debris. Oh, sorry. We must navigate by sight. It's so sensitive. We will make it. Now focus. <laughs> A tiny little flick. Oh my gosh. This is absolutely insane. Brother, be careful. Oh. I love how you can only hear very muffled sounds and then just Titus is breathing. I do wish there was a little less loading screens in this game, but I mean, that's a very small issue to deal with. place oh my lord welcome to demirius ow already what do we got oh we do have the hammer no way oh These guys actually are like crushing me right now. Boom, oh my, I'm getting absolutely peppered. got some force behind it. Is there Don't some people up here? Me. No. I probably should have taken something with a little bit more of a scope. I didn't realize that it'd be so, like, such far distances. Engaging front. There's something here. Stims. Moving. Under hold that terminate. It's got rockets. Reload. Dude, this guy's a beefy boy. And moving. My the only complaint is, is it's insanely slow. Battle barge now. Like I feel us. like I'm taking and more shots charging it up than doing damage. Oh, this it is shall insane. Be done. 
Are we going to let them beat us? The objective, brother. Not today. Oops. Oh, it's got some impact behind it, though. Wow, if I was playing with human teammates, I'd probably give this a go. Resupply. If I have anything, yeah. I would think I'm gonna this switch the chain sword. Well. As much as the thunder hammer is amazing and feels amazing, it is really slow to be playing with AI because we already know the AI isn't the most combat efficient to support you anyway, so. Engaging Engaging magazine. Sorcery. Fueling their barriers, no doubt. Dude, these guys are clobbering me, dude. What? What is hitting me? Oh my lord, I'm taking so much damage from these little guys. I should have grabbed this sniper. Ow. Your treachery ends now. I don't think I'm going to be able to just like charge in like I normally do against the Tyranids. Sorcerer? Oh, God. Got him. I love the ripping off the head. Guy here somewhere. The altar of corruption. Destroy it. Yes, brother. Let's get rid of this thing. Oof. Oof. Destroy. Up there. The impact will destroy this whole area. Wait. It is slowing down. Heretic sorcery. No doubt. But it will get us to our objective. Cool. It is probably a trap. Time is limited. You must take the risk. Move on to the cathedral. Oh! We'll the <laughs> Whoops. Am I already up here? Okay, I'm already Colossal. up here. <laughs> we are almost there. What is your status? The sleeping giant will soon awaken, brother. All for our signal. All right. We gotta move up. Nine locks, nine keys, nine beaks. You guys fighting something? You're right over there. Transmitting targeting signal now. Your signal barely registers, but I read it. Your oh, data is clouded, Lieutenant. Maintain close proximity to target. Dig in. Okay, so I think we gotta we hold this position. The Atreus will miss its target. We will not yield a single step. They will not deprive us of seeing them. Dude, so these guys are insane from... Oops. We These guys are nutty no from far away. Come, you won't change your bastards and die. They 
seem absolutely aim locked on me. <laughs> The traitors pull from their bastion. Dude, they're so strong too. Nice. In your Primarch's wretched eye. I feel like I'm mean, like it's said to stay close, but I'm not getting like anything like can I Oh here we go. The champion lies the feet of the Dude, I'm not doing anything from distance on these guys. Gotcha. Sword of Atreus, primed and locked in. Lock target now. Reaching signal data through telemetry systems. Numerous errors detected due to signal interference. Calculating trajectory. Oh my gosh, why are they just one-shotting me? Going for it. Might be useful, getting a little bit more range. All right, so we got to advance to the Mechanicus factory. We had successfully had the uh, the battle barge slam into uh, whatever that thing was. Oh, not you again. We will soon find you in the flesh. And remove you from it. You may keep it as a parting gift. <laughs> oh, this looks so epic with the graveyard and everything. I love how we're just flattening all the, the tombstones, man. No, I always forget to. God, the power sword is so epic, man. Back to the wall, you. It really is something to behold.
not so tough now, are you guys? I think I need to reload my, uh... Nope, got the reload up. The enemy seemed determined to destroy Aurora. Is it possible the device might work? That it could weaken them? Perhaps they seek only the power source. Why so we need to destroy Rose? this? I do not know, nor do I wish to speculate. We are here to end this folly, and so we shall. I love the one-handed crush of the orb. That's so sick. Show yourself, betrayer! What is it, brother? The artifact calls to you, Titus. And I will destroy it. To whom do you speak? You do not hear him. No. Petty oh, tricks. he's in our mind. He's playing with our mind. Help him out, men. of a Mechanicus macro weapon. An excavation site. Indeed. Our path leads down. Alright. I'm kind of vibing with the... Uh, well... Once again, <laughs> I press my ability. I was going to say, this, uh, I'm vibing with the weapon set that I got right now. The heavy pistol with the sword is, is amazing. Plasma incinerator. We got stems. Perfect. By order of the Adeptus Mechanicus. This is Lieutenant Titus. Request authorized. Denied. Aurora seal required. Identify yourself. This is infuriating. More heretics. We are on the right path. Dude, this weapon absolutely obliterates those guys. I need to get rid of these 
little guys too. There's one. Where'd the sorcerer go? Did we get him? Almost out of ammo. Holy. Let's go. The wombo combo, baby. Got some ammo. Restocking. Not a lot. I mean, this gun runs off like super heavy ammo. <laughs> that cannot be the last of them. Guess they're rear guard, no doubt. Stay vigilant. Yeah, like this thing only has 48 bullets to begin with, but it so messes them the up. Are Do you believe it? He certainly did. You said it was destroyed. Apparently not well enough. That damnable Archmagos. If it truly is tainted with corruption, then we must destroy it permanently. Agreed. Two med stims, that's good. That airlock leads into the mines. Gather inside. Entering quarantine zone. Decontamination required. Initiate biological purgation within the chamber. All right. Microbial index 1.2%. Initiating sterilization. Barely a sign of life on this world. It is a burial world, brother. Reserved for the dead. Oh, baby. We're going down deep. So it's interesting that the enemy is using his psychic powers to try and flip Titus. I feel like they're targeting him, one, because he's the leader, and two, he's had the medical issues recently. Microbial index reduced to 0.01%. It is safe to proceed. We haven't found any grenades in a while. Safe. Interesting choice of words. Pity this chamber cannot remove corruption. That duty is ours. What do we got over here? Melter rifle. I'm I'm loving the, the weapon set that I got right now. I'm not looking to change it anytime soon. Especially if we're fighting the uh the thousand suns. Ancient ruins. I keep calling them thousand suns. I'm assuming that's who they are. The subject of it, more likely. The figures in these carvings are unusual. Ancient marks of the ruinous powers. Etched by fools. Long before the Great Crusade illuminated this world. These were not made by devotees of the Warp. How do you know? You may soon see for yourself. Hmm. It really wants me to use the Bolt Sniper Rifle, doesn't it? It's always there. Oh, nah, I, I like the Power Sword too much. It's definitely my favorite. No grenades again. Where the heck are all the grenades at? I don't even know how useful the grenades are against these guys, but it's always kind of like a nice, oh, like if it ever gets overwhelming, you just kind of throw one right into the middle, especially the crack grenades that stick to them. Hey guys. The arch enemy have penetrated deep into these caverns. Perhaps all the way to your own device. Switch off heavy mode again. Holy crap. The damage these normal, tiny, little human, corrupted human guys do is wild. shield to come back so I'm not just taking going. more health damage. Your 
treachery ends now. These ruins are vast. What interest could the Mars Adams have in old stone? We know not what secrets this old stone holds. I only ask that it holds our weight. Perfect. At least they're providing a lot of stems. Like, I almost feel like these tiny little guys are doing more than these big guys. <laughs> Their aim is impeccable, and they're just melting through my my armor. Hey, grenades, finally. Restocking. This is just crazy to observe. Like the chaos just taking over everything is wild. This is by far the best mission in terms of AI-like performance. They are actually helping me fight the bigger guys and stunning them. You know nothing of brotherhood. Lieutenant. More cheap tricks. Calling the f calling Kelgar out is absolutely wild. Supply. Dude, this thing is nutty. This is by far the best weapon I've used. At least against these dudes. charges fairly quickly. We're almost out of ammo again. Reloading weapon. That's the trade-off. Extreme damage for really small clips. Not even small clips, Restore small amount it. of ammo. Why can't I pick that ammo up? There we go. Like 12 bullets in a clip is more than enough with, with these for these guys. It's the extra ammo capacity that's pretty lacking. Back to the wall. 
team that we're doing on these dudes. It's just non-stop like I swing, he swings. Oh, there's a sorcerer here. Look at all the stuff on the ground here. Whoa! No, every time there's a cool new one, my camera gets all tripped up. That's so sad. Send them to one fifty. God, I love the combat. <laughs> it's so good. Pathetic sorcery. This is all trippy. Oh, dang! I didn't even notice above. Imura, a boy. Spare your ammunition for the real thing. Fair enough. I die or chasing this bastard's phantom. Why install Aurora deep within these ruins? Perhaps it was already here. How? A relic from the Dark Age of Technology. This is heresy. They will no doubt invoke the Treaty of Mars. This damn quest for knowledge. It's true. What do we got here? More stims. Can't even use more. Stabilizing vitals. I don't know if I was full already, but we might as well top Munition up and then pick secure. up the extra one. Oh, here we go. How deep do these tunnels go? We shall see. Pull the elevator. Oh boy. We're gonna have to hold here. I can feel it. Visitors on it. Restocking. The elevator is almost here. With enemy reinforcements and all specs. Prepare a fitting welcome. Hey, boys. That'd be really cool. Uh, we probably actually want to grab one more set of ammo before we hop down. Here we go. Send deeper into the runes. 
place for what is to come. Oof. I don't want to know what's to come. Distracted from our purpose. All right, the boys. Well ahead of us. This trail will lead us to them. The sorcerer will elude us no longer. Move on the obelisk. Advance to Aurora. Hell yeah, we're finally here. That is such a cool shot. It's just like an obelisk structure in the background there. just keep my eye out for eye out for extra grenades and stuff there doesn't seem to be a ton of those things kicking around wait what it's titus oh they're playing mind tricks on us this is so weird Forgive my error. We will not let you down, brother. Have oh, no this doubt. is trippy. This is trippy. He's putting our teammates' voices into our head. Oh, God. Chaos abominations. You think so little of thankfulness of myself, of the great thief. This is a really sick mission. This is so cool. You got a sorcerer boss guy talking in your head and putting like false things in there. Yeah, your teammates who can't hear them. More minions. 
Lurking in dank holes like the thought they are. love how this game showcases the ruthlessness of the space marines because while they do like like for the most part good work they are freaking ruthless all of this was just lying under our feet this whole time and centuries longer still eons brother if the archives are to be believed and on more worlds than we shall ever wish to discover. I pray everyone is unearthed and burned to cinders. Listen to all of those later from the menu I found out. So you just go into like your collections and you can replay all the, the audio journals. So I don't want it to play over top of what's happening in the mission at the moment. This is so sick. Boys. Annihilated them. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting shot from up top. No ammo kicking around anywhere. There we go. Munition secured. Okay, now 
they look like normal enemies. one of the coolest bosses in a game in a very long time. I really, really like how they've done him. Like, he's just, you see him once, you fight him, you're like, okay, this guy's powerful, he gets away. Now he's like a voice in your head that's just messing with you and your team. It's, it's so menacing, and it's so well done. Here we got another med. Oh, well, might as well top up and then grab it. We're almost there. We might get one more video after all. This this last planet is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Oh boy. Aurora. It lays waste to the heretics. Where is Imura? The traitors are taking the thrashing down there. Let us add to it. Wait, they're like... They're like not active? This seems very weird. I'm scared. Is it Aurora doing it to them? Blind to all but his work. Thankfully, his diligence has not made him faster. Oh, here we go. Loose! Ah, Lieutenant Titus, praise the Omnisire. In just a few minutes, you will bear witness to... You must stop this! Sire, please. I know you have concerns, but look, this is merely a taste of what the device is capable of. And I have seen the worst of what it can do. My lord, you you must trust me. This has, has been my quest for knowledge. M my life's work. Shut it down. Now. I will not. Forgive me, Lord. Time will reveal the purity of my intentions. <laughs> you tiny grains of sand, traveling as you come. For a moment, it seemed you might do my work for me. But alas, I must finish this myself. Something is happening. 
Dirty work yourself there. doing my god Christ, that Aurora device, my lord. Ah, oh, man, this game somehow every single mission from start to finish 
increasingly gets better and better and more epic and more epic. Like, it's just insane how well they progress the story in this. Even if it is like a 10 hour campaign, the amount they get into it and the feeling that you have that you've started from where you were to where you are now is just so incredible. Look at their armor, it's all chewed up. All right, we gotta get to Titus the surface. To Acheron, do you read me? Damn it. How could that fool lose not have known? He took the whisperings of that sorcerer to be his own inspiration. Luz was merely a pawn. They killed Nozick, led us to believe they would do the same to Luz. So we would deliver him precisely where they wanted him. And that spectacle in the catacombs. Deceit to trick that puppet Luz into finishing the work. Oh my gosh. What? It is worse than I could have imagined. That pillar floods the land with corruption. Titus Dagger, I come in. Fox is useless. We must find our brothers. Oh no, everybody's going crazy. There's that monstrous obelisk. Extremes a silent wail of corruption. Their human minds were not prepared for malign energies of this magnitude. Few are. Should we show them mercy? We must leave that to the Commissariat. We have more pressing duties. Holy, this is nuts. He's literally flood everybody, all of our allies, receiving a coded locator signature. with chaos. Akaran signature. Not far from here. Can we trust it? I believe so. Mark it on all specs. Yes, brother. Knock down those heretics! Avenge by your sound mind! Yes, my lord! We are the fighter! You are your homeworld's memory, soldiers! Thank you, lord! We will fight to the end! There's so many of them. I just threw the wrong thing three times. Just threw, instead of dodge, I still don't like that button being there. It's the only game that that one type of button is in that location. Recovering. So, we need to clear that obstruction. Already on it, baby. <sighs> there must be a solution here. A foul sorcerer took the power source. Somewhere well defended, no doubt. Damn you, Hughes. How does this compare to Cryer? Incalculably worse. A warp rift oh of such size gosh. will permit the darkest of horrors to pass through. The fleet will be preparing an orbital barrage. Then we must hurry. Zero time to waste, that's for sure. Things are not looking good. Hey! Brothers. Friends! Actual friends and not corrupt ones. No victory. Your squad 
deck. We were spared that fate. The captain awaits you inside. Courage and honor. Courage and honor. Others. Oh, oh this does not look case. good. Woof. I have lost one platoon with five more at half strength. Our commissar cut down two dozen men, then shot himself. The weaker minded are gone. Titus, report! What in the name of Holy Terror do you call this? We failed to stop Luz. I can see that. He was tainted. An unwitting puppet of the arch enemy. We are now facing a warp rift the size of a small cruiser. Three volleys from the resilient and not a scratch on that pillar. If it has a weakness, I need to know what it is. It is powered by the artifact from Grya. If we can destroy that... Where is it? We do not know. You call that a solution? What is the alternative? There is a field around the pillar, impenetrable to our ordnance. We have observed their forces passing through it on foot. We must get close enough to see if we can do the same. Proceed through those doors. We make our assault imminently. Hell yes! It's happening, baby. Look how dope he is. Oh, is he fall? Oh, man. After you, soldier. Our forces are divided in two. I will lead the main assault on the Temple of Aethor. I sent two squads to move on the enemy's flank, but we have lost contact with them. They are carrying the company standard. If they have fallen, we will retrieve it, Captain. This is so cool. Ready! Oh, it's time, baby. I shall recite my legends. It's time. Everything has come to this. The front is beyond what the is this thing? Look out! Heldrake, spread out! Oh my god! It is impossible to dodge that if you miss the timing. Oh, we're fighting with everybody here. Oh, this is sick. If we fail to defeat the enemy, then I will burn this place. But I would prefer to not disgrace these honored dead. Can our scans locate the signature of the power source? We are blinded by all the interference. It is out there, at the heart of that profane madness. Agreed. One way or another, we must reach that obelisk. Then we shall. All right. It's all or nothing. There is no fail. It's if you fail, the planet's getting exploded. So. Titus, proceed on until you reach the second force. Hope to Terra, they still stand. We wait for command. Yes, Captain. The Emperor protects. The Emperor protects. Second company! Make ready! Oh, no. 
This is so friggin' dope. We just have to hold here. Oh, we keep going. I, I stopped to help the wrong troops. Tell your squad to hold off on using grenades until my signal. It's going to get a lot tougher the closer we get. So I can fathom that ten of our brothers may have fallen. Along with the standard. I dare not picture the company banner soiled by treacherous hands. Ultramarines do not fall without a fight. They are alive. But they may be in need of support. And we must move quickly. See him charging up. Not today, sorcerer. Two sorcerers down here? Reloading. The visuals on this planet are second to none. Like, really. Oh, this looks spoopy. See how the priests maintain these graves, even in the midst of this war. Their devotion is commendable. We must hurry. Our brothers pay in blood for every second we delay. There yeah, but there the might be some uh, cool things in here. Sorry. Our brothers can wait. Hey, see? Delarium is honored to provide tempo. This place is so sick.
message. Briefly. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's here, Kalgar, baby. The central obelisk appears to be the source of their power. It's protected by an energy field. Give me a solution. We've hit that shield with everything we've got. Nothing gets through. My lord! There may be a way. In the catacombs, Lou said all it took was a transference of alignment. And then he inverted something. An object. What of it? It was identical to that obelisk. You want to invert that? Explain. Your aura device might have a weakness. Might? Chapter Master. We cannot stay here. Lieutenant, you stand by Sergeant Gadriel's assessment. I do. Captain Akaran, muster your company. Aye, Chapter Master. Brothers! The heretics clamor for a taste of victory! But we will defy them this day, as we have defied them for ten millennia! We are the sons of Ultramar, servants to the Emperor and guardians of the Imperium. Let these wretches feel the wrath of ancient vengeance! Forces are through the field. Hit them hard, Captain. Yes, Lord. All forces fire at will. This is this is cinema. It, it like there's no other explanation for this game. This is just pure cinema at its peak. on that abomination! Yes, my lord! Captain, form a defensive line here! Company! Defensive line! Brother Titus, you will have only moments to execute your plans. Move quickly! Dude. This must be the control unit. Do you understand any of this? No. Lieutenant, do we have a solution or not? Stand by! There. That could kill you. We're out of options. We will handle the last one. I'll get them moving. Brief them over the Vox. Yes, Captain. Okay, so we gotta take care of three more of those. Meridian, Elasa, have you received new orders from Akaran? We have, brother. Moving to point Alpha now. Elasa on route to point Beta. You will need to rotate the small replica of the obelisk. But be warned, it will hurt. Not as much as it will hurt the treacherous bastards out there. That's this is so cool. Devotion. I will gladly volunteer. Go well, brothers. Absolutely annihilating me! 
turrets are insane. How is he so accurate? thing. Oh my lord. The champion lies defeated. A colossal demon hounds our forces. What exactly are we doing with these obelisks? The Aurora device opens a rift to the Immaterium, a gateway. These smaller obelisks appear to be the keys to that gate. We turn the keys and lock the gate. Exactly. All right, we know what to do. Through this door, brothers. Go. Treachery will be punished. Heretics, cast them into the abyss. Do not spare them your wrath. They're turning one. They're turning one. It's working. We gotta get to ours. See how it rides in agony. Who left? Tell us a report. This is Straven. It is done. May the Emperor bless you, Straven. I am but a lightning rod for his will. You may rejoin the main effort. Drive the main deep, brother. They have destroyed the us out. Watch their fire. They have the advantage. Oh, he teleported to us. Their close water skills are truly without match. Hey, our boys are there. Just kidding. Oh, it is our boys. I thought it was an illusion again. <laughs> Okay, they actually showed up. See, you never this underestimate a space marine. Work, An idea is worthless without those that execute it. I think my hearing is damaged. That sounded like humility. Oh boy. Where's Urge 
red dots when we need them. would be better. goes inside of the monster you're killing. <laughs> Hellbrute torn to pieces. Munition secure. Titus, Desmas has a hold on the Obelisk controls. Throne that looks like torture, but he is holding fast. Alright, that's the second last one. It's just ours now, right? Decimus. I have a murderous headache, <laughs> but the sight of that beast reeling is a fine tonic. It is indeed. Permission to join the front lines. Granted. My thanks, brothers. Emperor be with you. Viridian out. Alright, we got one last one job more. to do. when I wanted a Dreadnought to show up. It shows up, baby! It's the coolest thing ever! Oh, God, this game is epic! No 
I can't get, or like, um, barbed wire. I can't get through. There we go. Yes, my lord. crap the cinematic i want a movie or a tv show like this this is unbelievable this mission this final mission is by far the best experience i've had playing a game in 10 years this is unbelievable i know i sound like a little kid but this is <laughs> quite literally my biggest wish for a warhammer game all coming true in this one freaking mission It was a trap. Perhaps. It's this. The Immaterium. If it is, we must move quickly. To where? We must find Kalgar. They got rid of my chainsaw. left you to rot in the Death Watch for a century, Brother Titus. Coward! Cease cowering behind illusions! Make a bulwark of your hatred, brothers. <laughs> I smell fear! Mm -hmm.
bringing him to me! Enough games! Silence this heretic! One last dance before the strings are cut! Here we go! Emera, you're mine, baby!
This is nutty. intelligence. Titus, it is good to see you. Their sorcerer's power wavers. He is vulnerable. See how his domain weakens as he does. There is only one place left for him to hide. Let us dig out the heretic. We have Let's go. Within the energy stream. He prepares for another attack. It is the artifact. It must be. There is almost limitless power within that shard. So we must make haste, brothers. a boss.
brother. It is over. You did it. Brother! Holy shit. <laughs> like, I'm trying to just wrap my head around what that last two hours of gameplay just felt like to me. That, that, the only small complaint I can think of was I wish it was longer. I, I want them to pump out more of this. And I hope their roadmap includes more like campaign story focused content. Because I know a lot of, a big part of this game is going to be the multiplayer experience playing with friends, playing that co-op experience, going through side missions, killing waves, building out your marine. But my God. Lieutenant Demetrian Titus, your decisive actions have saved this system from ruin. And so it is with great pride that I now present you with an honor worthy of your deeds. The laurels of victory. Let every warrior of the Adeptus Astartes see that here stands the true measure of a son of Gilliman. For the glory of Ultramar. Courage and honor. Company dismissed. Forgive me, brother. It took me so long to bring you home. My lord, that is... Fierce was my wrath when I learned of your detention. In their arrogant suspicion, the Inquisition failed to recognize the truth. That no evil will ever overcome a devotion such as yours. Thank you, my lord. There is a mission. It will take you away from the Second Company for a time. As you command, Chapter Master. The Brother Chaplain will brief you. It was he that suggested you for the task. My lord, the Sword of Kalth is ready to depart. Thank you, Captain. My ship will convey you to your destination. I shall be glad of your company. Titus, it has been an honor. It has indeed, my Captain. I hear you'll be taking your leave of us. Not for too long, I hope. Emperor guide you. And you, sir. Brothers, I am called to serve elsewhere. You'll be missed, my lord. I will not forget the blood we have drawn together. Nor shall we. I owe you both a debt. You have restored my faith in brotherhood. We shall await your return. Courage and honor. Courage and honor. honor. Titus. Lord Kalgar has informed you of your assignment. Good. I will brief you en route. You are joining us. I am. Very good, my lord. 
You have done well. You have won the trust of your brothers. And of the chapter master. But know this, Titus. The stain of suspicion never completely fades. I will be watching you. Should you falter on the path for even a moment. Oh. I will show no mercy. Leandros. My lord, it is time. Damn! I gotta say, I mean, from start to finish, that game just never ceased to, like, surprise me. There was so much cool stuff in that. I mean, also, can we just touch on the fact that Leandros is now the chaplain? Like, that's gotta piss off some people. <laughs> that's based on him from, like, anyway, that, that game was, like, yes, I, I will say right off the bat, it's an extremely, extremely linear game. If you're not a fan of linear games, you probably won't like that style. However, I still think it's worth playing because of how unbelievable the combat feels throughout the entire game. Every single melee weapon feels different and unique. It offers different types of attacks. The weapons, while I don't feel like I used all of them in the campaign, I used a vast majority of them. And they all felt like they had all the, like their own perks. They had all their own advantages. Like by the end, that gun that I was using was absolutely destroying the chaos agents where it was doing nothing to the Tyranids. And I had to use a faster paced gun to deal with the Tyranids. The design of the world, the design of the, the creatures and the players and everything. Like I actually can't fathom how well that game visually looked, felt, and portrayed what the Warhammer 40k universe has built over the years. That was just an absolute epic journey from the, like I said, from the second we launched the first mission to the end. It's just like those cinematic moments were just so epic. Like I'm actually like completely breathtaking with how, like I said, the only complaint that I have is that I wish it was a 30, 40 hour game. That's a game I could spend that much time playing a campaign mission through. That's how good it was. Total, it was probably close to 10 hours, maybe a little less. And I hope their roadmap, like I said, I hope it focuses more on the story elements as well as the multiplayer, because I think both have their place in this game. And I got to give a credit to the devs. This this game, I think in the, the five, six episodes, however many this was, we had maybe one tiny blip where I lost a little bit of frames while it was loading a new scene. Other than that, this is the most optimized and out of the box best experiences that I've had with a game in no joke five to six years. We've had other games that have performed great after some patches. We've had other games that never got patched but were pretty good. This was start to finish unbelievable. The music was good. The creature design. The Tyranids were freaking menacing, man. That was, that was amazing. Like for me, if I'm just, if I'm just basing it off that campaign experience without having played any multiplayer yet, out of 10, I'm giving that a nine out of 10 only for the fact that I know a lot of people are upset with the fact that it's short. But you look at modern day games and unfortunately there's not a lot of single player aspects to modern day games and they don't take very long. A lot of them are 10 hours or less. You look at the Call of Duty games and they're, yes, primarily focused on Warzone and multiplayer, but the single player that they build is like five, six hours. So this is more than that, less than a lot of other games, but just the energy that I felt like there was, I'm not joking, there was a moment where 
Calgar came in that I, I haven't played 40k in years. Years. I played Space Marine 1. I know the 40k world. I've played some other games here and there. That moment made me emotional. Seeing the Marines standing on the hill, you know that they work better as a unit. They had that distinct ultramarine look as the enemy was swarming them. And out of nowhere, Kelgar, the big bad boss bitch from the ultramarines, swarms in like a like the true leader that he is. And then that start to finish, the boss was... I talked about it. He, he, like, the way they designed him was just so awesome. The fact that he lives in your ear for that entire two hour last mission and you're fighting him and the mechanics of the fight. I was on normal and it felt challenging. Play that on two difficulties higher. And like, I can only imagine what it feels like. Like that, I'm gonna let the credits roll here at the end of this video, just because of how impressive they should feel very, very proud of what they've achieved with this game. It was a long wait to get this game. And man, oh man, I cannot believe that he is chaplain now. That that reveal actually was like, oh, oh. I know a lot of fans were not happy with him in Space Marine 1, so. Oh man, just the boss fights were good. The, the enemies, the, the large enemies felt menacing. The swarms of Tyranids felt like you were in danger all the time, but then the brutality of the Marine just comes through and you overcome in just the most obnoxious, brutal ways. And yeah, it's... That was a great game. Like I said, 9 out of 10 in terms of we're just focusing on the story element, if we're just focusing on the single player experience. I cannot wait for my friends to pick this game up and us dive in there as a unit of three and tackle all the side missions, tackle the second half of when Titus and his crew are off doing their thing, you get to experience the other half of the mission. Great game. Great game. Wow, I'm, I'm trying to process anything that I didn't just touch on, but... Jeez, I, I, I can't think of anything negative uh, other than what I just talked about. Like... I don't think it'll be a game for everybody. I, I think that you have to enjoy the combat enough to deal with this the the but what what i got to say about the the it being super linear is is yes that's not for everybody and people would love an open world in this in this universe but i think they do such a good job with the draw distance and the scenery and the music and the feel of the swarms and everything that's going on in the background i said this in like episode 1 i think you're going to take the time to look around and observe and really take in the world they've built that the linear stuff isn't going to be the first thing in your mind while you're playing through these missions. It's just not. There's enough variety of different areas that I think you're just going to be overwhelmed. And you're not going to really be like, oh man, this is just a straight linear game. Like some people will. But man, if you're, if you're an active player of 40k or you're a fan of the, the lore built behind the Ultramarines and the Tyranids and the Chaos, the Agents of Chaos and all that sort of stuff... I, I, I got to think that you're going to be moved to, to emotion with this game. Because I, I haven't played it since I was a teenager, since I was a kid, and I was moved by it. It makes me want to play 40k, and that's a problem, because it's so damn expensive. <sighs> but yeah, all these people you're seeing, I, I try to do this, especially for games that I really enjoy. I try to let the credits roll, because it just shows you how many people go into making these games a reality. Like, hell, it's even saying HR, accounting. These are all people that, that are putting their blood, sweat, and tears into these projects. And it, you can tell this was made by people who really care about the 40k universe. I just, I'm, I'm trying to think of moments from that two hour. First of all, I do like that each mission feels like its own little, like, campaign mission that you're playing in 40k. Like, that last mission... We, we're now at 2.05. Yeah, we've been running credits for the last five minutes. That's a two-hour final mission. It's not that often that you get a full two-hour, non-stop, start-to-finish, story-driven, amazing gameplay mission that just funnels into everything perfectly. It doesn't slow down. It doesn't have moments where you're like, ah, this part I could have done without. No, 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 no. Like, it just keeps fueling and fueling until this epic moment. Wow. I am 1,000% going to be trying this on a harder difficulty 
once my friends get this game installed and play it. And the only thing I can say to people if you're on the fence is, yes, I know price points of video games nowadays is pretty rough. If you're still hesitant and you don't like that, it's still only a, you know, seven, eight, nine hour game. Maybe wait until their, their roadmap gets a little flushed out. But if you're somebody who enjoys multiplayer experiences and you're going to be playing both, I got to say this is one of the most worth games I've played. And that's including the fact that it's only an eight hour game. I've put money into so many video games that I've spent 50, 60 hours on and not got near as much enjoyment out of them as I just did playing through this, this game for you guys. And the first thing I'm going to do is go create a Black Templar, and I cannot wait. Although I don't know, I'm assuming you need to unlock some things and, and do all that, but... That villain right there is one hell of a... is one hell of a vi villain. I didn't see what part they're thinking now. These are all just, like, single names? Focus Entertainment, man. Come out of nowhere and drop this absolute gem of a game. Wow. Also, kudos to the content team that is showing right here. The content team was just pumping out, like... Uh, this was a game that I've seen, like content quite literally on for so long now like it's it's been years and i've been seeing just such cool pieces of social media video content whatever it might be like they did a hell of a job marketing this game you go to the steam steam client right now and the first thing you see when you're under the store is this big beautiful moving like it's an animated banner for space marines 2 and if you don't get hyped just seeing that banner there's something wrong with you This is a game where, like, if I was ever to get into game development, this is the style of game that I would love to be passionate and work for. Unbelievable. I just want more. I'm so sad that it's over. But it's not over. Like, my, my journey in this... This will be the last video I likely post on for this playthrough because we all know how multiplayer games can go and... There's a lot of negative people and toxic people out there. I don't I don't necessarily want to record multiplayer stuff, but this is just the beginning for my playthrough on this. Yeah, I got to go back to the roadmap and see if they are including any more story missions because I could play Titus forever. That was... He's so epic. And hey, at the end... Gad... Galad, Gad... Galadriel, Jesus, Lord of the Rings. Um, whatever their names were. <laughs> I can't even think of their name. Gadriel, I think, was his name. It turned out to be alright. Turned out to be alright. Made some good decisions there as a, as a leader, as a future captain. Yeah, these credits, I mean, this is like not even the biggest studio. And you just see how many people put their, uh, put their lives into making a game for multiple years. Oh, man. Oh no, we lost connection to <laughs> There's no way we just lost connection. Oh well, all right, there you go. Well, unfortunately, all those folks whose names were uh, were gonna come up after, we lost connection to the Warhammer servers. That's unlucky. But there you go, there is only war. Continue your fight. Although Titus's story is over for now, that's a good sign. That's a good sign. More story content, please. The fight has just begun. Continue the battle in one of the other game modes. We have operations. Lead a unique combat squad to complete missions in operations game mode. Choose war gear, upgrades, and appearance customizations. And then the Eternal War. Conquer your fo foes in Eternal War game. Unlock your cus uh, customized equipment while competing against others in a multiplayer game types. So that's basically it. You, you have your full... Yeah, Gadriel and uh, Charon? Sharon. You have your full multiplayer experience. And then uh, you have your operations, which is the some, some, something I'm going to be doing with friends that I'm looking forward to drastically. We're not going to get into that yet. I do just want to, like, walk around and see, just before we end this, if there's any, like, hidden Easter eggs. Like, we have ship repair down below. <laughs> the sight of a thunderhawk swooping out of the hangar. Might not have anything. Does he have his wings on his helmet? He doesn't. Can we put those on? 
or not the wings, the, um, no, we can't actually put on his little, uh, judgment things. That hammer, it was badass. It was just slow and I'm not a fan of slow weaponry. Uh, that's a little unlucky that you can't equip his new helmet wings. These guys just waiting for duty. I don't think there's going to be anything hidden. Yeah, we can't even traverse this. So that's all right. It is what it is. That was an absolute blast. I hope you guys enjoyed that from start to finish. That was one of my favorite videos I've ever done on this channel. So thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all the love and support on this playthrough. It's meant the world playing it and seeing your reaction to it. Sub to the channel. There's going to be a lot more. And we're also going to come back to this game once they add even more in the future. So until then, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you're taking care of yourself and we will catch you back here in the next video. Thanks guys.